Passion Episode 2 Thank God I came on time. Or else the servants would have thought that Mama is sleeping. It's still high. What is the matter, Auntie? What are you worried about? Thank God, I have no worry. You just know my sorrow. Auntie, hold him by his ear and get him married. You're his friend and son, you talk to him. You talk to him. That he should get married for Mama, till when will he mourn her? Memel is happy in her home. This is what I'm sad about. He doesn't forget that girl anyway. I've shown him the best girls. But he says no to everyone, like he has sworn to not get married. I think, will he stay alone like this? Auntie, what are you saying? How won't he get married? We will get him married. You just take care. Yes, child. You talk to him. Yes, baby. I'll surely do it. Yes, I said it. Yes, of course. I'll talk to you later. Bye. Sam was telling me that it's your birthday. Happy birthday. You remembered when Sam told you? Yes. Sam is prettier than me. I don't know. It's possible. I can't tolerate you befriending new girls every day. You chose this life. I came to you. Didn't I? I found out Dad has fixed my engagement with you. Yes. Then say no. Break this engagement. Why? Because I have no interest in you. And the one who wins takes risk. And I want to take that risk. I will win your heart. You'll get tired running after me. You're tired already? I'm the mother of your daughter. So what? You have this house, this great standard of living. What more do you want? Your love answer. I'm sorry, I can't give you all this. Answer. Heather, get married man, why do you worry auntie? Look, if you had gotten married on time, you would have two kids. That to school going. What's your plan? Okay, you go home. Sis and law must be waiting for you. And I'm also very tired. I'll go and sleep. Whatever. Good night. <laughs>